actin filament now we are going to this is goes to myosin filament structure of myosin filament after a complete of actin filament actin filament will consisting of a troponin and a tropomyosin and a, there is have a troponin we consisting of a three segments one is goes to tnc or tnt and tni there are superfinished now we are going to myosin myosin also there is have a some helical structure of part will be there the helical structure of part and one is a small neck part the helical structure of part is goes to tail and uh, there is a middle part we call as a neck and it is goes to bulgy part and uh, we call as head head neck tail will be there where it is presence in the muscle is goes to like this is the myosin he will be there well, like this this is, is the present like the myosin heads like this is presence mean to towards the towards and the, from the jawline to the to towards okay like they like that uh, this myosin filament to attach to the actin filaments towards the myosin heads are projected that that myosin heads neck and the tail part will be there head be consisting of a two centers one is goes to actin binding center one is goes to active sites active binding binding sites actin binding site second one is goes to atp binding center atp binding site there are two active centers are there one is goes to actin binding center second one is goes to atp binding center troponin we consideration as a <coughs> trover actin filament we consideration as a regulatory but is goes to it is motor or mobility part we consideration as a myon filament become myo filament we consideration as a motor filament and actin filament we consideration as a regulatory um, filaments will be there that right, this is a uh, head uh, neck and tail will be there it is present to towards like this this is about m line a zone it's uh, a zone is must be consists of a h zone in the m line will be there towards m lines it is a uh, myosin filament myosin head is towards to the m line will be there from the z line to to towards m line will be there this is about arrangement of myosin filaments okay right now we complete about uh, what is uh, actin filament and what is a uh, myosin filament will be there and uh, how the actin and myosin filament it show the movement first we must be that uh, motor unit before we are going to here we discuss about one more small topic is goes to triad system triad system triad system is goes to simple t tubule means a troponin tubule t tubule along with uh, two terminal sister name terminal sister name club together we consideration as a triad system okay once again triad system means t tubule along with the two adjacent or two terminal sister name we consideration as a triad system it's a very very important one the triad system will be there now the muscle get excited the muscle show the movement first we must be that that it receive the muscle must be receive the signal from the nervous system nervous system nervous system means nerve ends to the muscles muscle we call as neuromuscular junctions neuromuscular junctions or neuromuscular joint neuromuscular joint neurons of the, of the central nervous system they receive the signals from the various sense organs and it is give the response by the motor neuron the motor neuron is connected to the muscles in the in between the junction we called as neuromuscular junction or motor neuron muscular junction will be there it is a supply to the signals means it is receive the stimulus the muscles must be show the excitability excitability will be there it shows us this type of contraction will be must be poses when we excited this type of uh, signals is received by the muscle here is goes to sarcoplasmic reticulum sarcoplasmic reticulum they get activated to release us to the calcium ions to release us to the calcium ions these calcium ions are going to bind into the tnc 
TNC center means troponin the center TNC center the calcium is bind to the TNC center then the TNC center is binds that's why what are the masking of TN T or TNI what are the molecules the configurational changes will be appears in the behind of these molecules there is a have a actin active center will be there to remove the molecules actin centers is open that's this open type open opening of such active sites this active site is going to bind with the myosin head in this reaction the ATP is utilized ATP is utilized ATP is site is present to the myosin head utilization of ATP is a formation of ADP and uh, inorganic phosphate and IP the ADP the site is ready to take the energy to site is ready when calcium is bind to the TNC that myosin head is comes to the attached to the actin active centers that it show the movement when construction of muscle movement will be takes place that we called as power stroke this is goes to power stroke we have to see how he is going to see that that is have a some sequential form we must be sure that uh, uh, muscle contractions